If you have medical questions, you've come to the right place because we have answers. It's time for Ask Our Doctors. And we have a very unique question from Don. Don, what's going on? Well, about 13 years ago, I woke up one morning and my sheets were purple. And I just assumed that it was like dye from my clothing, so I just blew it off. Then the next day it happened again and I realized that it was actually coming out of my body, out of my pores, and I was actually sweating purple. It's happened for the past 13 years off and on randomly, so my question is, why am I sweating purple? I think you may have a very rare condition called chrome hydrosis, and that basically just means colored sweat. And so what we think is happening is there are glands called apocrine glands that secrete the sweat a certain type, and they can sometimes produce pigment. And we don't really understand why this happens to people. It's been reported in the dermatology literature for almost 100 years. And you can see all different colors, like red and yellow and green and blue, and you're blessed with purple. Um, <laughs> there was was a actually just last year interesting study that raised some thought that there may be some exposure to heavy metals that may contribute to this. So in that study, out of this, this case series, which again, it's quite rare, about 80% of them either had copper containing IUDs or they consumed mineral water where they were consuming kind of metal content. So the upshot is that if that's what you have, it can actually probably be diagnosed with a blood test, a urine test, and a biopsy. Now there are also other cases called pseudochrome hydosis, which would not have these same results. It's still produces colored sweat, but that's actually all from the outside of the body. So we think that there's bacteria, there's dyes, there's certain toxins on your skin that then come in contact with the sweat and cause that. If all your other testing is negative and it turns out it's just the pseudochrome hydrosis, that actually can sometimes be fixed just by withdrawing whatever it's causing it. So possibly an antibiotic or getting rid of that dye. But there is an answer. We don't know necessarily if we can cure it, but at least that might help fill in some of the blanks because I know this has been troubling you for a really long time. I thought I might have been an alien, so at least that's not. <laughs> <laughs> You're definitely not an alien. We can tell you that <laughs> for sure. Thank Don, thanks so much for sharing that. It's time to get legal! In the doctor's court. Joining us, Judge <laughs> Then. Our next guest is a United States Marine Corps veteran. And now, well, he's spending his time saving the planet. I parlay those hard fought military skills to now fight in this battle to save the planet. Plus. I woke up one morning and my sheets were purple. I think you may have. The doctors.